Welcome to my channel Lemon Code School Java Programming Tutorial. Today, we'll dive into one of the fundamental data types in Java, int. What is int in Java? The int data type is short for integer. It is used to store whole numbers without any decimal points. In Java, int is a 32-bit, sine 2's complement integer, which means it can hold values from minus 2,147,483,648 to 2,147,483,647. Let's go practic. We open IntelliJ and click on New Project. And I give a new name in my project. You can give any name you want in your project and check Java and JDK and check then if you select add simple code to check the build with the main default code and remove it then click on create we go to src and right click on new and Java class and left click and give name to my class. Remember camel case in Java class means capital first letter. I will give a name print integer with letter P capital and I integer capital. This means camel case and click enter between the curly braces. We write the main method public static void main string args. Between the curly braces, we declare for an int variable in Java, simply typed and followed by the variable name. For example, int my number, declare a variable named my number of type int. You can also initialize an int variable at declaration time by assigning a value to it. For example, int my number equals 25, declare and initialize my number with the value 25. It allows for more practical. Work because you can declare an int variable without initializing it, and then assign a value to it later. In this example, in my number, declare variable, my number equals 10, assigns a value to it. Finally, we print the value. In my number, digital equals 10 system dot out dot print on my number digital equals 10 You can reset the int variable to a new value. Here, my number was initially set to 15, then reset to 20. The print statement displays the updated value. Int my number 1 equals 15. My number 1 equals 20. System dot out dot print on my number 1.
If you want to make an int variable immutable, use the final keyword. This declares the variable as a constant. Any attempt to reassign a value to a final variable will result in a compilation error. In this example, final int my number equals 25. Declare my number as a constant with a value of 25. Trying to reset it to 30 will result in an error. Final int my number equals 25. My number equals 30. System dot out dot print on my number. Let's create an application to perform calculations using it. It can perform various arithmetic operations using int variables. Here we have the variables x and y and we perform addition, subtraction, multiplication, division and modulation. The results are printed on the console. int x equals 5, int p equals 10, int sum equals x plus y, int difference equals y x. int product equals x asterisk y. Int quotient equals y slash x. int remainder equals y percent x. System dot out dot print on sum plus sum. System dot out dot print on. Difference plus difference.
system dot out dot printon product plus product System dot out dot printon quotient plus quotient System dot out dot print on remainder plus remainder. Good job. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more Java programming tutorials. See you next time.